All right, so we got one of our first interesting things here that we want to share with you. Um, this we found yesterday while we were tinkering around with stuff. So this is obviously a 12-valve piston. This is um, one of the pistons actually that came out of this motor. So if you go back and you watch the um, the video that we had posted about the early 03 with the bad engine sound, this guy, and you can still see, let's see if we can find, oh yeah, I think that's part right there. You can kind of see where it had chunks of valve seat that were embedded into the top of the pistons and this one isn't even the worst um, but what we wanted to show you real quick and this is just an interesting find um, somebody else will probably say oh my gosh I already knew that and then somebody else will say oh that's that's kind of good to know so if you look here we've got our compression ring there and it is beat to pieces and it's just hashed but that's actually not what we were going to look at and you probably can't see it very well but I'm going to try to get in here and I'm going to try to flip around so you can see it in the light without getting in the shadow if you look at that ring you'll notice that the bevel on the inside of the ring so the one that would fit all the way into the groove uh, the piston ring groove and that has got a bevel on the bottom side of the ring. Let me see if I can rotate it there. You can see the bevel on the bottom side of the ring. So this is an early 03 motor. It's got a dot. Flip it around. Where's the dot? There. Now you can see it if I get it out of the shadow. Okay, you can see the dot on the top of that piston ring right there. So you can see that the dot is supposed to go up and the bevel is on the inside, on the bottom of the ring, okay? So that's a early common rail piston right there. Um, gonna go ahead and set that guy off to the side. And now we have 12 valve piston. So if we look on this guy, we haven't fooled around with these things or anything. Um, if you look on this guy, I forget which side, the, there's the dot, so that's up. You can see that that's the way it's supposed to be. And if you look here very carefully, get at the right angle, you can see that that has the groove, the bevel facing up. And what's interesting about that is, in most of the literature that I've read, um, the bevel goes up. And in this case, on the early 2003, and probably some other ones, the bevel is clearly supposed to be down. So the reason why I point that out is, number one, it's kind of an interesting, I like random tidbits of information. Um, but also, if you're putting these together, maybe that just helps somebody pay attention to what style and how theirs is supposed to be. So first random tidbit of information from this build right there about the, which way those rings go on different styles and years.